Hey y'all, it's your girl Noir Veganista, and today we are doing a $60 haul, y'all. So, what does that mean? In my household for 2021, we've decided we're, we're only spending $60 a week. That's right. Six zero. Why you always lying? For two people, myself and my daughter. I know it sounds crazy to all my foodies. They're probably like, what are you even saying, girl? But trust me, I'm sticking to this because in 2021, if we're going to be bad and bougie, we got to be bad and saved up, honey. And I decided to do a challenge at the end of 2020 and highlight every time I use my debit card for Uber Eats and Chipotle, y'all. Out at restaurants being a foodie and the amounts I spent at the grocery store. And I realized that I was spending thousands of dollars on food and produce that I was potentially throwing in the garbage because we just have this hoarder mindset. And so I'm not doing that. Instead, I'm sticking to a list, sticking to the budget. And I typically let the budget not include cleaning products or toiletries in that matter. But this week I have toilet paper and paper towels that still fit into the $60. So stay tuned, y'all. I have my little Vanna White today who's going to assist me with some of the things that I have on the lower bottom um, part of my little bench here. But yeah, y'all, how have we been doing with our $60? I think we've been doing really good. <laughs> we've been eating a lot of non-processed things. That's also part of this goal is to get rid of all my Morning Star burgers, garden, the Morning Star buffalo joints. Please stop. <laughs> I had to let that stuff go, y'all, because the sodium content on it was getting wild. And we'll talk about that in a later video. But yeah, not as processed as um, a vegan as I used to be. So that helped me transition Gabby into a vegan lifestyle. But now that she's eating the lentils and the black eyed peas and lima beans and things like that, it's good, huh? Mm -hmm. You know, there's no point for me to buy that processed stuff all the time. All right. So I'm going to have Gabby help me show you guys what did I get in this $60 haul. I went to my local Safeway. So if you're in the DMV area, you're very familiar with that store. Um, to my people that are up east, or, no, eastern, up east, <laughs> east of here, north, something like that, y'all. Anyway, my family's from Connecticut. So Safeway is equivalent to almost like a shop, right? Um, not price, right? I said shop, right? You know, high, like, you know what I'm saying? It's like a shop right or um stop a shop giant brand so if you're familiar with that ralph maybe on the west coast um publix ish you know doesn't have as much variety as publix but yeah it's similar to that so let's talk about what i got okay can you help me with the stuff that's at the bottom vanna white <laughs> come on vanna all right so organic tortilla chips blue joints we like um tacos and nachos and salsa and all that so we always keep these on deck they were two for six and so there are two of those what else we got bro y'all i'm not messing with bounty scots all the, you know them people whatever for my paper top really avalanche I'm not messing with them about the paper towels. So I have been buying the store brand. These joints probably were like $5. And I could check the receipt to kind of fact check y'all. But yeah, I grabbed these because it's just paper towels. I don't need them to have special colors. It says comparable to sparkle. That's cool, whatever, because I'm running through these by spraying up stuff. It's COVID, wipe down them surfaces, and you throw this shit in the garbage. So there's no point in me spending a million dollars on paper towels. Okay, okay. Then... I used to be a Scott's name brand aholic when it came to my tissue. And one day I had in the Safeway app, which I'll talk about apps and coupons and how you can keep your, you know, budget. They gave these away for free. So these are fragrance free, open nature, bamboo bath tissue, soft and strong. Let me tell y'all something, y'all. Again, I said I'm bougie when it comes to the tissue. These things right here are crap, okay? Again, $5, six rolls. I mean, come on, made from bamboo, like, it's bougie. I like that. All right, my girl gonna quickly show you that I got two things of spring water, pop them up there. Those are about a dollar something a piece, so that's in the budget. That's everything at the bottom? Yep. All right, now let's talk about when things are on sale. 
So these are Safeway's version of um, Apple Jacks, okay? I'm not too bougie to pick up the little store brand and see what it's hitting for. And what I look for in Safeway, which really excites me as a vegan, is this 50% sticker in orange, okay? So typically these were $2.99. It's 50% off, so if y'all could do the math, it's about $1.50. That sounds good enough to me to grab two of those bad boys. And there also was a coupon in the app, which literally bought the price of both of these to like 77 cents. Yes, I said 77 cents. Okay? I buy my produce on sale. Now, typically with the Dirty Dozen, which means the food that you eat the outside of, I like to go organic, but if I can't, then I won't. And so, no, this is not organic broccoli, but still, it was 88 cents a pound. I only got a pound's worth, which was about a big florette. And so, this cost me 88 cents. Very simple, very cheap. Little bag of walnuts, okay? Dollar something for these. I like to throw them on top of my smoothie bowls. Now, if I was going to be making something else, and I needed more, then I would have definitely bought a bigger bag. But I just feel like this week I'm going to do a smoothie bowl and put this on the top of it or an ice cream, etc. Green onions, about a dollar. One of my pricey items, tofurkey slices, the oven roasted because I'm going to make sandwiches. Eventually I'm just feeling like I want a little soup and sandwich situation going. I have some tomatoes that are like almost on their way out of here. So I may make a grilled cheese or a grilled oven roast that I guess is supposed to taste like turkey. Turkey and cheese um, and make like a nice tomato soup. So I'll get rid of produce that I have from last week's $60 haul. Salad, I can't beat that. Wheat bread for my sandwiches, okay. Store brand. A pound of red potatoes. Like, y'all see, I'm picking up a bunch of stuff. Like, they're like, what? Three different types of yogurt this week. And normally, I don't pick them up because of the sugars. But there's still something in me that's like a junkie to try new things. So, Almond Breeze um, has some new flavors, y'all. So, it's a vanilla and a strawberry. And let me see the sugar content on this bad boy. 16 grams of sugar, which... Mm, um for the strawberry and 11 for the vanilla so i'm kind of curious about those and i also picked up because i love chobani's oat milk i'm trying the chobani oat little granola pack joint um strawberry granola crunch now this one let me check the sugar for y'all 18 grams y'all that's a little high that's a little high but i wanted to try it so we must be bag of french fries to a brand produce was on sale y'all buy one get one free so one pack of uh strawberries which again i'll be using for my little either in my yogurt or i'll make a smoothie bowl again blueberries for free so anytime i see that i check my circular y'all check your circular if I see things are on sale, then I'm definitely in the store and I'm trying to stay within what's in season and what's on sale. Whatever store that you decide to just shop at, you know, and I'll do an Aldi haul on a later date and, you know, it's definitely cheaper in there. There's no app for them. But if your store has an app and it has coupons in there, then you really want to try to utilize that as well. Just because you're vegan does not mean that you can't coupon. They are starting to be definitely vegan friendly with some of the brands and things that they offer. So don't fall short, y'all. Some bananas. Now, I do prefer burrow bananas, but since I was on in the store and eventually I'll probably make some banana bread, I just grabbed a quick little thing of bananas. Y'all, we still in the $60. Like, what? <laughs> Two boxes. Oh, look, that's upside down, y'all. Uh, Nature's Bakery. So, this is a brownie joint. Y'all see that little orange sticker on there, right? So, again, Retail price $4.49. It has the 50% off on these joints. And then if there was a coupon for Nature's Bakery, that will also come off of the total. So if you're not a couponer, definitely I can do some videos on that as well. But for the price of one, I got two. And I love these joints, okay? They are definitely vegan. They're crack. I love them. And every now and again, I want a little snacky snack. So I'm thinking I could make some nice cream with the brownie joint with a little bit of walnut. <laughs> Get it? <laughs> See how the girl, she always around, y'all. She be she <laughs> three apples because we're not wasting. So again, because I'm going to the store every week and I'm upholding the $60 budget, I have some apples from last week. I only picked up three more. 
you finish the joints and then you're able to go back to the store. Stop over buying and then your produce is dead and you're throwing it in the trash. Trash equals waste of money. Trash, waste of money. Trash, waste of money. If you're not going to eat it, you have no use for it, don't pick it up. Don't pick it up. And I got the bonnet on today, so y'all know I'm yelling at y'all. Don't, don't play with me, okay? Two plantains. Still in my $60. A $3 pair a year. Now, that was a little bougie for me, you know? But hey, now and again, I just want to burp. Like, you know, shout out to the vegans that ain't afraid to say, I got to burp. I got a little indigestion, you know? So, whenever I tear up something, I think I'm going to make some black bean burgers tonight. I'm definitely going to have a little pair a year on the side. I also bake um, with Perrier because carbonated water and box mix cake. It rise, baby. You don't need no just egg. You don't need none of that applesauce conversion, chia seed, flaxseed. I'll definitely do a video on that later, but carbonated water, box cake, rises. And the last thing that I have, which I have double of, so I don't have to necessarily show you both of them, but... It's the Open Nature brand, which is their organic brand for Safeway of apple cinnamon um, instant hot oatmeal. So my daughter loves these in the morning. She just adds her hot water, stirs them up, and keeps it moving. Again, retail price on these were $3.49, so they're 50% off. Price of one, I get two. So anyway, y'all, this is just a quick $60 haul. Um, I will definitely show you proof of my receipt so y'all don't think I'm capping on y'all because I'm not. Like, share, and subscribe, y'all, if you really like this video. If you would like to see me do a haul at another store that's potentially in your area, put it down in the comments below, and I'll definitely do that because I can definitely do an Aldi's haul. That's my favorite place. I might even do that one live, y'all, in the Aldi, okay? Let me show you how to spend that $60. So whatever your budget is for your family and your family size, put that in the comments, too. I'm curious to know what y'all doing if you designing on a dime over there, all right? Like, share, subscribe. Love y'all. Peace.